Magandang araw mga ka-striker. Huwag na po natin patagalin. Gaya nga po ng sinabi ko sa aking unang video, atin pong i-highlight sa pagkakataong ito ang mga opinion po at reaksyon ng ating mga kababayang Pilipino sa Macau. Sa kautosan po ng uh, pamahalaan ng Macau na lahat po ng uh, Philippine passport holders ay kinakailangan ng mandatory nucleic acid test. At ito po, umpisahan na po natin. Ang mga reaksyon at opinion po na ating babasahin ngayon ay galing po sa mga komento po ng ating mga kababayang Pilipino sa Facebook account po ng ating uh, Philippine Consulate dito sa Macau at sa mga iba pong uh, local news dito sa Macau. At ito po ang una. Fellow Filipinos, I sense discrimination here But may I remind you all that we are in foreign lands. This is how they run their country. We need to comply if we want to stay. Don't make hard for others that are willing to abide the rules. This is sickening. Science toes to one side and racial profiling by mindless and narrow-minded individuals. Becoming policy. Viruses don't discriminate, people do. Oh, okay, even those who aren't going out for work aren't exempted at all? All right, if it's for the safety of everyone, we have to do it as long as for free. Yes, a lot of Filipinos get positive of COVID because they are considered essential workers. Guys, It's not discrimination, but for the safety of everyone. Through are not true aren't Filipino who brought the virus here. Macau government love the Filipinos, so our safety is one of their priority list. Don't panic, guys. It's for free. Be thankful. Disgustingly discriminatory. This virus does not discriminate among races. So why does this government play it out like this? Shame on you! To all my Filipino fellow men, we understood where your emotions coming from and your feelings are all valid. However, let us be mindful expressing it here publicly. Yes, there is a freedom of speech but remember, everything is permissible but not everything is beneficial. At this difficult time, hope we will choose to spread love, hope, and positivity, light, and love. If nationality is the basis, 10% of those cases are Filipinos. Okay, sure. How about the remaining 90%? I am very sure that more than 50% of the infected people are Chinese locals. So why only Filipino need to do compulsory NOT or the nucleic acid test? The Macau government love and care Filipino community. That's why they want all Filipinos must test daily for our safety and free from COVID-19. Filipinos are hard foreign workers here in Macau. I don't think this is discrimination. It's for our own safety as well. Even if we think it's unfair, may magagawa ba? Masasabi ba nating ayaw ko? We can't kasi nandito tayo. Wala tayong magawa kundi sumunod. Pagpasalamat na lang tayo at free. Mas okay na yon at antayin na lang matapos to. Amen. This rules is not fair to stay in helpers like me. Since the COVID start, I didn't take my day off. I'll go out only to take the nut together with my employer and her family. I follow the Macau rules. How if come or how come that all Filipinos so sad to be fair. I hope and pray that this pandemic will end and back to normal. It is another form of discrimination and racism. Sad. 
but I think it happened because of so many Filipinos are being arrogant in commenting on their news and it is one way of their revenge. Typically Filipino with no contentment on what they have, always complaining, no satisfaction, why not we pray instead? Following health protocols is not only for local sake, it's for our own good. No need to tell them that you are clean and hygienic and they are not. As long as we are at the land of Macau, we must obey. Don't think that you are better than the government officials of Macau. You're not in the Philippines. If you don't want to obey the rules, then the immigration are widely open for your departure. They are so unfair. I am staying and I never go anywhere except for the swab test. And I am with my employer and after swab test, I back to house at once. It's so unfair. Ito po susunod mga ka-striker. Natawa ko dito. Chill-chill lang siya. It's okay. No problem. It's not a big deal. Every day go outside is happy. Stay at home is affected our mental health walking every day is one of the best exercise oh di ba chill chill lang siya aminin na lang natin na may mga kalahi talaga tayong pasaway ang problema nadamay ang mga matitino pangalawa mga workers tayo ng Macau sumunod tayo sa batas nila para din naman sa atin yon at yan nga po mga ka-striker, ang mangilan-ngilan lamang po sa mga naging komento at sa mga naging reaksyon at uh, opinion po ng ating mga kababayang Pilipino sa Macau. Dahil po sa pagbaba po ng uh, mandato ng uh, gobyerno ng Macau na lahat po ng may hawak ng Philippine passport ay kinakailangan na everyday na magpaswab test po. At para po sa kaalaman ng mga karamihan mga ka-striker, the Macau government is stressing that it is not only Filipinos who are the, they are requiring for everyday not. It's also the people of Macau and other nationalities who have yellow codes and red codes. It means to say hindi lang po Pilipino ang nire-required ng gobyerno ng Macau na mag-everyday not test po. Kundi po, pati rin ang mga locals at mga ibang uh, lahi po na mayroong yellow code and red codes. At galing po sa investigation unit po ng Macau, kaya nila nire-required ang mga Pilipino para sa everyday not ay dahil meron po tayong mga little gatherings. Kagaya po ng mga little birthday parties, nag invite sa mga bahay-bahay, mga nag inuman na grupo-grupo at ang mga ito ay hindi po uh, gumagamit ng face mask. At yan nga po ay napatunayan dahil meron po mga nahuli na kapwa nating Pilipino na nagpa-party-party po sa kanilang mga kabahayan. So that's why po nag-decide ang Macau government na isa ilalim ang lahat ng mga Pilipino sa everyday nucleic acid test. At hayan nga po mga ka-striker, sa inyo pong palagay, may diskriminasyon nga po ba dito o purely health protocols? Nasa inyong kami na po ang pag-uusga mga kay Striker. Once again, maraming salamat po sa inyong panonood. This is PH Striker saying God bless and bye-bye.